couple weeks ago, uh, I was over at a friend's house. It was on a Saturday night, about two weeks ago. And we had spent a good amount of time together, um, you know, just talking over things that we did growing up, things that we enjoy now, things happening in our lives. And at one point we were talking about our favorite books. And so as we were talking, uh, one of the things that he did was he brought out a book, a thick book of poetry. And um, one of those, one of those books that looked like uh, one of the old style encyclopedias. So it was a fat book, and he opens it up, and he starts reading, and he says, you know, this is my favorite poem, uh, and this is my favorite author. And uh, he read with such passion, he read with such fervor, that I wanted to bring it to you today, to share it, and I don't know that I'll do as good of a job reading it as he did, but I will go ahead and, and give it a try. It's about the indomitable spirit, the human spirit, our ability to not only survive, but to thrive and to stand tall when there are circumstances that just keep coming against us. And it seems like it's not going to end, no matter what chance throws at us, we have the ability to stay strong, to stay resilient, and to thrive. And so, I'm gonna go ahead and read it. This is by William Ernest Henley. Out of the night that covers me, black as the pit from pole to pole. I thank whatever gods may be for my unconquerable soul. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced nor cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody, but I'm bound. Beyond this place of wrath and tears looms but the horror of the shame. And yet the menace of the years finds and shall find me unafraid. It matters now how straight the gate, how charged with punishments the scroll. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. <laughs>